I gotta do something when I'm 3D sculpting. In the description, I can write Nomad Sculpt. In the video, I can even say I'm sculpting in an app called Nomad. In Nomad, my masks start off as a solid piece. Even the title of my live streams can say App Nomad. And even the title on my YouTube videos can say Nomad Sculpt Tutorial. And still, in the comments, people will keep asking, what app are you using? I'm not mad, I'm just asking how. In my lives, I usually write it on a piece of tape. Today, I have a more permanent solution. I want to create a really clean looking attachment that goes onto the case of my iPad Pro. I followed the plan that I sketched in Blender and added text. Click tab to edit the text and I'll type Nomad Sculpt. If you made it this far, in the comments, type what app are you using? Change the font, added some thickness, with extrude and then I gave it a little bit of bevel. I've been really learning some simple 3D modeling techniques in Blender and any chance that I get to solve a simple problem in life I'm gonna take it and combine that with 3D printing. The letters are gold and the attachment is the same color as my iPad case which is black. It took only an hour to print in my bamboo x1 carbon. It's really thin but it measures 23 centimeters across. When I finished printing I snapped it off the build plate. It was flexible and the back really felt like film. Let's see if it fits and if it lays flat flush on the table. It fits nice and snug but not too snug so I can pop it off really easily. I did make a mistake. I didn't make a hole on the top right corner for the power button, but I have easy access to the volume buttons. From now on, when you see me sculpting on my iPad, making tutorials or going on live, you will see on the top, Nomad Sculpt. I was thinking about other things that I can do really simply with the same technique. I made a derivative of my favorite tag. It's a key tag that I added the dead mouth design and Stealthy the Emo Ghost. If you're a beginner at 3D modeling, post your work because it's gonna be so much fun to look back on. 